Welcome back to the cabin everyone. Here's a short little video. I had a couple questions about my trailer that I pulled behind my snow machine. This is just a otter sled is the brand name. I put this uh, blue high fax on the runners to help it slide better in the snow. On the inside of the sled, I put this piece. It's actually a piece of conveyor belt. And the reason I did that is because when I put the high fax on the bottom, I had all these bolts and my stuff was getting cut up from these bolts, getting down in the grooves and then get rubbed on these bolts and getting tore up and stuff. So I put this piece of conveyor belt on and I just put a couple bolts through it to hold it up here. And also, I don't know if you can see this, but I got this anti-slip tape that uh, you put in like showers and on steps and stuff I put that on here and it does a real good job of keeping my stuff from sliding around next the other mod I made is I put these bolts on these eye bolts through they're just bolted up underneath here with a locking nut and a washer on the bottom side a washer on the top side and then these eye bolts and what what I do with those is they're for the bungees here. I just loop the bungees through like this. This one's a little bit stretched out, but. And then I also have these ones that go this way. And between the two, it keeps all my stuff pretty much where I want it. It doesn't slide around much. It doesn't bounce up and down too much. And the other thing that it does is when I have the cover on here, before I had these bungees, the snow machine kicks up a lot of snow and it would just fill up with snow in here and would end up pulling the cover off and it would just be laying in here with a bunch of snow. So now as the snow machine kicks snow up and I'm riding down the trails and stuff, they're bouncy. These will bounce a little bit and bounce all the snow off. So it keeps basically the snow off of the trailer also. That's the short overview of uh, my snow machine trailer. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to give this a thumbs up and leave a comment. Let me know what you think about my modifications to the trailer. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Thank you everyone and have a good day.